church God puts in my heart that we have to surrender to him oh, we gotta surrender because when we surrender to the one that's in charge we know who's writing the chapters in our life we don't have to tremble or stutter or hesitate under his, unto his presence he has the word he has the pen to continue writing the chapters on your life we just have to surrender to him so he will do unto your life what the desires of your heart are. But it goes back to surrender. Sometimes we put our prayers onto the altar, but before we leave church, we grab them back. No, we got to leave them there. Leave it, the, leave it on the altar. Leave your prayers, your worries, your concerns on his hands and let him do. Allow him to do. Don't take it. Okay, this is my prayer. I'm going to take it back. I'll bring it back next Sunday. And I'm going to put a tracking number. No, let God do. Yeah. Allow the spirit to do. And what God said put in my heart is that we have to be a living testimony of what the scripture is in our lives. Some people just don't look at the Bible no more. They got no time to look at the Bible. They are too new age. I'm too old fashioned. So if I'm old fashioned, my word, my living, my way style has to be according to the scripture. So my living testimony will bring all of us to Christ. Wow. Let our lives be the word that other people see yes, yes. through our testimony. Because they're not, they got no time to read the Bible, but when they come to you, they see, oh, testimony coming through. A testimony, a flashing light of your lives is going to draw all of us to Christ. All of us to fill these empty chairs through our testimony. Through our testimony cannot be on you Sundays. You gotta be the way you talk, the way you dress, the way you move by the living word. Ooh, I heard one time, if you don't worship God, the stones will worship, will cry out to Jesus. Ain't no stones speaking on my behalf. No, no. Come on, to God be the glory. Now I know we not, I, I know y'all ready to go. I just know y'all ready to go. But Sister Kiel, you had one thing to say. Jesus, Jesus. I'll tell you what, before we, yeah, if you had one thing to say, what would you say?